perfect day to be outside, especially at a festival. It was really nice, a little breezy, and we did start to see the clouds filter in. Now that's a sign of what's going to be changing through the rest of the day and then getting into tomorrow. So yeah, now we're starting to see the radar light up. We had a very nice start to the day, very nice middle of the day, second half of the day. Some of you, just a few of you, are going to see a few light showers that are rolling through. Not for everyone. Most of these haven't made it through the downtown area, although they are sneaking in through some of our uh, western and southwestern suburbs. As far as what to expect, well, temperatures not going to move a whole lot, but we may be able to drop another five to eight degrees off of where we sit currently. We have had that breeze that's been mainly right off of the lake for many of you, so it's picked up a little bit along the lake shore. That's why in Chicago, most of our winds have been 10 to 15 miles per hour, gusting at times close to 20, a little breezy at times. This will be coming down through the next several hours or so, but staying anywhere from five to 10 miles per hour. Watch future casts. I want to walk you through the rest of your weekend. So if you still have plans for Sunday or maybe you have Monday off, as I know many of you do, I want you to know what to expect through tonight. Here's future cast. Notice the showers developing. They develop overnight, but the best chance I think is going to be right around daybreak or so. So in the morning between, let's say 530 and 730, we'll have some showers roll through, especially to our south through about midday. That chance is going to remain. But after that, I think the chances are small. They're not zero, but they're smaller during the afternoon. Could be a couple of isolated pop ups, but really more clouds and anything else through the rest of Sunday. Once we get into Labor Day, very quiet and warming up a little bit. So I think Labor Day is going to be a pretty good day. Here's Sunday. Tomorrow's forecast. Notice the rain and showers in the morning. Then we'll see some clouds in place, maybe seeing some sunshine as we clear things out. Temperature staying in the mid 70s. My producer liked this image so much of a Dorian just to kind of recap. Look at this. We're losing some of the sunshine. So I wanted to get one more last view of that visible satellite imagery. Just a very impressive storm. And if you missed it earlier, I'll show you the track one more time. Some improvement here, but also a lot of question marks here of uh, where it's going to go. There's that uncertainty with the track of it right there as it approaches Florida. Then it gets right into the nook there, right off the coast of Georgia, and then moving up the Carolina coastline. I have a sister in Myrtle Beach. My family's all in South Carolina. So, of course, we watch this one very carefully. Let me hit the seven day forecast very quickly to show you the next two days. Showers tomorrow. After that, quiet for a while. Then we bring showers back in late on Tuesday. A lot